क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टीन कंप्लीट क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्सटीन द फेसेस ऑफ अ डाय बियर्स अ नंबर जीरो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव इफ द डाय इज रोल्ड ट्वाइस देन फाइंड द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ द डिजिट्स ऑन द अपर फेस इज जीरो We say solve the example of dice, but the number is from one to six. But in example number is given from zero to five. The die is rolled twice. Therefore, the sample face is seen, but not one to six, zero to six, zero to five. So zero zero, zero one, zero two, zero three, zero four, zero five. Then starting from one. One zero one 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 two one three one four one five. Starting from two, right? Two five. Then starting from three, three zero to three five, four zero to four five, and five zero to five five. So total number same thirty six. Then of yes equal to thirty six. First let A be the event that the product of the digits on the upper basis is zero. When zero Out of that two numbers, one must be zero. Then multiplication will be zero. Remaining multiplication is not zero. So all number which contains zero, they are taken that in the set A. So A contains zero 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 all six zero 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 one zero two zero three zero four zero five. Remaining cases where there is zero, take all numbers one zero two zero three zero. Four zero and five zero. So this six and remaining five. So total numbers will be eleven. Y of a equal to eleven. P of a equal to y of a upon y of b. Therefore, answer will be eleven upon thirty six. Question number seventeen. Do the following activity. Two activities are given. I take my number itself. You in the school number of students get. I take number. You number here has no problem. Activity first. Total number of students in your class. I take y of a is equal to forty. Number of students from your class wearing spectacles. Y of a I take number of students who wear spectacles. Number of students are ten. Y of a is equal to ten. Probability of a randomly selected student wearing spectacles. P of a equal to y of a upon y of a. Therefore, ten upon forty. Ten upon forty means one upon four. Then, for the activity of randomly selected student not wearing spectacles. Out of forty student, ten students wearing spectacles. Therefore, number of student not wearing wearing spectacles will be thirty. So, P of b equal to y of b upon y of a. Thirty upon forty zero cancel probability will be three upon. This is the first activity. Second activity decide the sample space you will sell and fill in the following boxes. Sample space I take a die thrown from the die thrown to number from one to six. So sample space is yes equal to one two three four five six. Therefore, yes or yes equal to six. Second, here the condition for event A is getting an even number. Out of that, even numbers are two, four, six. So A equal to even numbers two, four, six. Number of element one, two, three. Y of A equal to three. Then P of A equal to Y of A upon Y of A. That is three upon six. Three ones are three. Three two are six. The probability will be one half. That complete the chapter number five. I take two three example extra because this complete the problem set five also. So question number total seventeen are there. Seventeen will be completed.